guys, so welcome back to Everything iOS today and there's been an update to the watch and it's some great news for all the people who live in the uh, UK for the ECG feature. Now it's been very, very debated on over the last couple of months whether it, the hardware is even in the watch. Some people think it isn't, some people think it is. I've always be uh, believed that it ha has been in there. Um, and today with iOS, uh, watch OS 5.2, uh, it's been released in the UK, so all them debates and then people are saying that was a rip off and we should have been told and all this. So we had to do, guys, is wait, uh, wait a few months and just be patient. And today's that day where in the UK we get this feature. There's also a couple of other countries and places where this has been released. I think it's Hong Kong was one of the other ones, but there is probably now around about twenty. 30 somewhere between eight of countries where it is now available so that's really good i'm not sure how many it was rolled out to today or yesterday evening i'm not sure when the update came out i realized this morning <clears throat> so yeah guys this is a quick uh little update on the apple watch ecg feature uh that is now available in the uk so i'm very pleased with that guys um I've just done a test there and it's all good. So it works fine. Um, let's see if I can give you guys a be upside down view, but it's just showing how it works. So you just gotta hold your finger on the digital crown, that activates it and it starts reading. And I don't know whether this just sounds gonna be absolutely great because I put my finger on it and took it off by accident. But yeah, guys, I will uh, just wanted to inform you that it is now available in the UK. I'm sorry about the sound quality of this video. Um, I am going to invest in a, in a mic soon. And then also all this information goes into the health app. Uh, and it stores in, it categorizes a sinus rhythm or irregular rhythm. So... Just great news to the UK guys and just putting this quick video out there so we can get all this debating over whether the hardware is in there or whether it isn't. We can now definitely confirm, which I've always known really because they've never really mentioned that there's two types of watch, one with and one without, which is what they've kind of done in the past for LTE and without LTE. So yeah guys, it's fantastic news. Uh, I'm happy to have this. I hope you guys go ahead and download 5.2. I highly recommend it. Because this feature is one of the big parts of the Apple Watch Series 4 and we have sort of felt left out over the last couple of months here in the UK as well as other countries but it's now left the, the States and it's been pushed around the world so thank, guys, thank you guys and uh, please check back for more videos later in the week and please like, subscribe and comment thank you guys, bye